Now, we have to eat our magnesium. We don't, our body does not produce it. However, our bones are reservoirs of magnesium. So as we're eating our magnesium, it seems to get stored in our bones and then it's extracted as it's needed. Believe it or not, magnesium seems to be involved in, the, as the data says, over 300 different enzymatic systems and, and processes that go on in the body. So there's a lot going on here. But one of the main things that a lot of people don't know and understand is that magnesium has a very big effect on circulating vitamin D. In fact, you could actually go outside for 30 minutes, but if you don't have enough magnesium in your system, it's very hard to convert that vitamin D. Why do I keep going on about vitamin D? Vitamin D is your main circadian pacemaker. This is the vitamin that comes through your body through light, right? And it actually helps your body stay in the circadian system. So by taking magnesium, you're helping your vitamin D, which is actually helping your circadian system. The recommended daily uh, allowance is somewhere in the 400 uh, or so 420 milligram range. 